One of two sites NASA is studying as a possible location for a new commercial launch complex is located near the western edge of Mosquito Lagoon. NASA happens to own the land, but it's also part of both the Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge and the Cape Canaveral National Seashore. The 200-acre tract, referred to as Site 2, is a veritable Eden home to unspoiled wetlands, mangroves, salt marsh, scrub. Scrub jays, wood storks, white pelicans, kestrel falcons, bald eagles, and several other protected species inhabit it. The public can view it. Environmentalists call it one of the five or ten most magnificent wildlife refuges. It could, however, go the way of the bulldozers, unless NASA comes to its senses, or unless the public and elected officials, like Florida Senators Nelson and Martinez and Representatives Feeney and Weldon, defend it. Site 1, which is part of the refuge, isn't part of the National Seashore. It is, however, host to an extraordinary array of wildlife and appears a more viable option, if push comes to shove. But the best option for a commercial launch complex would be locating it on an abandoned launch site on Cape Canaveral Air Force Station. NASA, though, doesn't yet see it that way.